A hiking we will go, a hiking we will go, hi ho the Mario, a hiking we will go. What's up guys? It's me Dayton here. I'm hiking out here with Jake. This is our, that's our breakfast table. That's our kitchen for the, for the time being out here. But that's the trail behind me, you can see. That's where we trekked in last night. Um, it was pitch black and we heard lots of noises last night. So I kind of had some nervous sweats beating down my back. Um, this is kind of where we camped. We already pitched our, or put our tents up and stuff like that because we're getting ready to, to head out. But we just got in really late last night, found our ground, started camping, couldn't sleep very well, but we're on kind of day two. Here we are, on our way down to catch some fish. I got my fishing pole here. Jake's got his fishing pole back there. Here's this little beach. Face down in the desert now. There's a cage locked around my heart. I found a way to drop the keys in my bed. Right next to the water here. It's weird. You see a fish jump, man? I can never take the world alone. I know that in my weakness I am strong. But it's your love that brings me home. We were on obviously day two of the hike. We didn't catch any fish earlier. And if you haven't noticed yet, what's up, man? You having super duper fun? Super duper. <laughs> He's like, never said that word before. And there's a trail we're heading on to right now. And you probably noticed my fan. This puppy right here. Lucky check, dog. check it out. Oh, look, check it out. So jealous. Oh. You both get in there. That's a key item right there. You want to get some of this? <laughs> So this is kind of a pit stop we're doing here. Nice little sandy beach across the river. I'm using my little, it's called a Sawyer. Bam. Uh, Jake's out of water, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna fill up this little dealio here, put my Sawyer on there, and then push the water out into his canteen so he's got some fresh water. Pretty cool deal. So we found this little creek here, and that's what we're gonna do. Except I peed upstream, so. You're the blood of my blood. We can get through it all. Brother, let me be your shelter. Oh, this fan. Oh, this fan. Big slide. You going a big, big slide. slide? I heard a snake. I swear. <laughs> So Jake, when's the last time you've done something like this? Never. First time. Never. Never. And I haven't done it in a long time either. Homeboy's from, uh, where are you from? Iowa. Atlantic, Iowa. That's right next to where Poseidon lives. I could be the one to call when you feel it Brother, let me be your fortress. Pretty sure that that's 
five star bathroom right there. Shower. What do you say, bidet? Yeah, there's a bidet in there. Yeah. It's like Narnia. It doesn't look like anything. When you walk into it, you're in a whole new world. <laughs> the heavy? Oh, a little bit. I told you heavier than yours. <laughs> you're bigger than yours. Here's where we're heading next, straight up that giant hill into the unknown. Oh. Oh, I got this one. Yep, got one more. Yep. Don't want it to move. Shake it on. Wiggle. Got to wiggle. Wiggle. <laughs> wiggle more. <laughs> Look at this hill. I'm sick of hills. The only positive thing about hills is going down afterwards. Ah. Imagine a zip line from here. Wouldn't that be awesome? Well, that wasn't scripted at all. <laughs> 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 but it would be pretty awesome. Look at that, this is going straight down from there across the river. And you can just let go and fall in, you know, if you want to. We were thinking about going over to those guys and asking if they'd give us like Gatorade or anything cold, you know? Cold Capri Sun. A zip line right into their freaking cooler. Feeling my way through the darkness. Guided by a beating heart I can't tell where the journey will end But I know where to start They tell me I'm too young to understand They say I'm caught up in a dream Well life will pass me by if I don't open up my eyes So that's fine by me So wake me up when it's all over Big giant hill. Dayton left me in the dust again. See him down there? Way down. Look at him. What's he doing? Is he... Are you alright, man? Yeah. <laughs> Are you pooping? Getting ready to stop, have some lunch here at uh, Bear Creek or Bronco Creek. Uh, we haven't seen any place to fill up our water canteens in a while, so this is pretty exciting seeing this little creek here. So we'll use a sawyer and fill up our canteens and have ourselves some soup. Found this nice flat rock here for uh, our cooking our goods. Yeah, our, our kitchen. kitchen. Jake wow. needs some shades, he switched up his shorts. Yeah. This is the nicest More shorts I've ever seen. More comfortable. Look at that back. The wet. You just drip that right into the Sawyer, you know, and it'd be good. Making some dinner. Got some ramen noodles. Blowing some water. And then this one here, we got some, uh, some soup. A little pour on top of the noodles. A little lentil. So that should be pretty good. Jake's down there using the Sawyer to fill up the, the water while I slave away in this hot kitchen. That big old thing. Here in the full rusty. We haven't found the tree that Rafiki like drew Simba on. We came up to our next campground here at, where are we at? Bunker Creek. Bunker Creek, Bunker baby. Creek, about 9.1 miles in. It's got a cool little bridge right there. It's got a cool little Jake right there. What's up? Happy to be done for the day. Uh-huh. And then there's a creek down behind Jake that we'll get our water from and such. So. And bathing. There's my bathroom. My Fun tub. stuff. Yeah, we're gonna go my take tub. a bath. Ice baths on the legs. Ice bath. Yeah, ice baths on her back. <laughs> Jake smells like molasses. So. I wish. Got campsite number two ready. Then took a bath. 
Got my little hut set up over here. All of our kitchen supplies behind me here. Jake's tent. And then I took a dive down the river. It's cold, really cold. But I washed my clothes as well. And as you can see behind me, I said that's the creek we went into earlier. It was nice and freezing cold. And I made some Joe. I don't have a cup, so I'd use my pan. But it tastes delicious. Look at that view. The river there, looking all wet and stuff. You know what I'm saying? Now look at that view. That's that's Jake Larson there. Kelsey Creek. The sweet bridge here. Jake's thinking about doing a cannonball. I'm gonna do a cannonball. Right in this cool view here. Hold my beer. <laughs> Jumping over. If we only had a beer. You know. <laughs> cool little area, campsite up there. Somewhere, it's pretty cool back there. Hope I get the chance to travel the world. But I don't have any plans. Wish that I could stay forever this young. Not afraid to close my eyes. Life's a game made for everyone. And love is the prize. So wake me up when it's all over. When I'm wiser and I'm older. All this time I was finding myself, and I didn't know I was lost. So wake me up. Here we are once again, campsite number three, which is a legitimate campsite. What is this place called, Jake? I don't remember. Jake? Sitting next to me in my big old full of the orange thing here. <laughs> yep. That's what we do. We're both exhausted, I'll tell you Drinking that right now. a bunch now. of water. Tons of water. We ate dinner already. Tucker Flat. Tucker, Tucker Flat. <laughs> I don't know how to say it anymore. Yeah. We went 15 miles today and we're both pretty exhausted. My feet hurt. First thing I did was get water and went down to the river behind us and just set them in there gently as they absorbed nature's cure. <laughs> <laughs> wow. You know, you gotta have some, you know. <laughs> Jesus. Anyway, there's Jake's tent again over there. I know it's not, you know, nothing special about it. <laughs> I'm almost out of water. <laughs> He's almost out of water. He'll have me go get him more. I'm his slave. I made dinner. <laughs> <laughs> I'm I'm out of it, Johnny, right now. At least I didn't burn my finger. <laughs> Was the prototype like three stacks on that CD? An example of the perfect candidate now. All your girlfriends say that you don't want to see me. You're the reason that I just can't concentrate. I've been trying to fix my pride, but that thing's broken. Made my way down. That little, this little oasis down here. This is where I cleaned my clothes and dipped in my sore feet after our 15 mile hike yesterday. I sat over here filling up my water canteen until 
I saw Jake. There's a up at the top of this trail. This you can go left or right. I went right, and then he was gonna follow me down. He went left over this way, across that little pool. He was sitting in the rocks over there. But anyway, it looks pretty down here. This is kind of what we had to we got to see when we came down last night. Which is pretty cool. And we're getting ready to leave. Unfortunately, we're heading up to Mario, which is our last stop before Jake's wife comes and picks us up. So we had a had a fun time. Great run. My feet hurt a lot, actually, which some people might think that's kind of wimpy, but I haven't done a hike like this ever, so I thought I did pretty good. It's his Rogue River Trail right there. Me and Jake grew about a mile away from their destination, and we're pretty excited about it. Just got to Miro Lodge and we're doing some exploration to see uh, what this place is about. So after some discovery, we found this little bench out here. The uh, owner of this facility, Miro Lodge, she was generous enough to show us where the sodas were. We got ourselves a nice cold coke, yeah, which is pretty exciting. Yeah. And she let us hang out here on the dock here. She said we normally have to book, but she's been pretty generous and she let us hang out a little bit. So we're going to wait right here and hang around the lodge until we get picked up. So we just got done checking out Muriel Lodge, which is a pretty little place. They had great hospitality, and they gave us some muffins, which is kind of cool, and they're refreshing. Um, we sat out on their patio for a little bit while we waited for Jake's wife to get here to pick us up. And now we're on our way back on this road here, hiking back to kind of a fork in the road while we wait to get picked up. Little boy. That's not a compliment, Jake. Listen. <laughs> Camera shy over there. He's about to start busting out some vanilla ice. Come on, because Jake. You look like vanilla ice's little boy. Oh goodness, he's reckless. <laughs> reckless. I don't know. I think we spent too much time together. What do you think? Jake's over there whittling as we wait. There's a bear right there. Where's the mom? That's what I'm worried about. Oh my gosh. Hey, bud. Oh, he's gone. Yeah, let's get out of here for mom. I want to see mom. 